I'm Mark Diplock. I'm here with Mike Holmes Inspections and we are here as part of the Homes Approved Homes program. There are certain stages of the building process that we actually go through. Today we're actually going to cover what is called the envelope inspection or the framing structure, building envelope, mechanical roughness. This is one of the inspections that we actually do as part of the Homes Approved Homes process. If there is a problem or a defect, we can actually catch it now. Here at Xena Homes, we're third generation builders with decades worth of building experience. And we take pride in our custom built homes and how much effort and uh, attention we give to detail in order to make sure that our craftsmanship exceeds the standard level uh, that's required in building a home. Mark and I will all go together and do a small tour of the house a mini inspection and make sure that everything's up to par. We're going to do a couple of these phase inspections just so you get an idea of what actually happens behind the walls and everything else that's going on with these houses that nobody else sees because uh, it's all being done during the construction process and by the time you actually buy this house, move into this house, you don't see what happens in behind here. We're here to basically help you with the quality control and the quality insurance of building your house. We're here to help make this whole building process go a little bit smoother for you. We're a second set of eyes to help you build a better house. You guys get an electronic copy of this report. It goes right to your email. So you can actually open it up right on site and go through the pictures in the report and boom, 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 boom. You can actually have it fixed within an hour. I love the fact that Zana Home actually uses these gaskets just for all the ventilation problems and that. We don't see that a lot, unfortunately. This just kind of shows some of the extra quality that Zana Homes puts into their end product. And that these will prove a, you know, a nice great seal, uh, help prevent any air leakage from going into the house after the house is finished. Because again, once the brick and everything goes on here, we're not going to see this, so we want to make sure it's all installed properly now. We've got some little penetrations here. Uh, you know, things that get missed, but this is the stuff that we're looking for. We're going to document this. What you're going to see here is actually another wrap that goes around here. And this is all part of the air barrier system here. We have this wrap that comes down, overlaps this particular air barrier. This air barrier actually goes in and, and tucks in underneath the sill plate, goes through and comes back up and wraps around into the house again. And that way we have a continuous seal going all the way through, top to bottom, around the inside, and that way that will prevent any air leakage from getting into your house. So long as this is sealed properly, and this is one of the things that we're actually checking for right now, this house is going to be nice and tight, and it's going to be a very comfortable home to live in. You know, things get torn, things get ripped during the construction process. Uh, it happens. And this is, what, again, one of the reasons why we're here, just to make sure that these things can get noticed and get fixed before they get covered up. Part of our process, though, is what we do here is we actually walk around the house one direction and then we actually go back around and we do it another direction because you never know what you're going to see from a different angle but that's just the thoroughness of the Mike Holmes inspections and that's part of what our training process goes through with all of our inspectors as well. We make sure that we have properly trained guys that know building construction. All of our inspectors actually have a building uh, background whether they've been carpenters or electricians they're all versed in building code so we know that as well and we just want to make sure that we're providing the best possible uh, trained professionals that we can for our builders as well. Things are just a little bit short here. Obviously, you know, we're going to get some ceiling in there, but it wouldn't hurt, you know, just, just to carry this uh, one Tyvek barrier a little bit more. And it's just a matter of a fact of actually teaching some of the trades that are installing this as well, because sometimes the trades just don't know. Uh, so we can help, we can educate them on that. And, you know, once they're aware that, you know, this could be a problem, the problem's fixed again and chances are we'll never find this problem again once that trade knows you know a little bit better on what to do. It just keeps increasing the quality of these homes. We got a quality home here to begin with. We're going to make it just that much better. And that's the beauty of this program. That's why I love it. So what do you think, Mark, of uh, the outside so far? You know, everything's actually looking really good. Um, like I said, there's always a couple small little minor uh, problems here and there. We got them documented. We're going to get those fixed. So I think uh, we're done out here. Why don't we move on inside?